What's going on YouTube? Thanks for stopping by. My name is Mike, also known as Hyrule Dude. Today we're going to be going over how to do a complete max upgrade, ultimate upgrade on your Sheikah Slate sensor. Now this is really useful because you're going to upgrade three of your runes and then you're going to have the ability to literally find anything you want in the game, literally. Um, so it's such a cool and useful and powerful upgrade. So make sure you follow along because this actually has a few different steps to really maxing it out to the to the fullest. Um, don't take these sun shrooms here. Make sure you leave them there, just so you know, um, because that's actually going to be a part of this. So let's talk to Pura and uh, let's see what she says here. I'm going to fast forward it a little bit. And she's saying if we bring her some ancient materials, she'll upgrade our sensor, our Sheikah Slate. Uh, so for three ancient shafts, she'll upgrade the remote bombs. And for three ancient cores, she'll upgrade the stasis. And for the Sheikah Slate sensor, she will upgrade it for three ancient screws. That's it. She'll upgrade this. So that's the first part. And I'm just going to fast forward this now. And Simon was saying something about the Sheikah sensor and he has some interest in it. But we're going to get to that in a second. Because that's another important part to this whole uh, upgrade. So we upgraded the remote bombs and now we're going to upgrade the stasis. So now we're going to go over and talk to Simon. And he asks us to take a picture of the sun shroom outside, which we did. We're just going to show him uh, the picture and he gives us the hearty truffle. And now he says that he has some news about uh, an additional Sheikah slate sensor upgrade. And this is where things get really cool. So basically what he's saying is that um, the Guidance Stone will be able to add pictures to my Sheikah Slate. Which will basically allow me to have my Sheikah Slate target any picture I select. Making it to where I can find anything I want in Breath of the Wild with my sensor. He's willing to give me just one picture. And so let's go ahead and do this now and upgrade the Sheikah Slate to just the one picture. Now, Purr is kind of giving a hard time because she wants, she doesn't want to give it away for free, but she's going to hook me up anyway. So she's cool. <laughs> she's she's adorable. Okay, so it transferred the picture of a silent princess, right? And we're going to go ahead and talk to Simon again. He's confirming that the picture was in fact transferred from the guidance stone. So that's cool. And so that gets us ready for the next phase of this upgrade. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> and it won't be free from now on either. So we can add more pictures to our Sheikah Slate. So let's talk to him again. And we're gonna tell him we need a picture. And this is where things, in my opinion, get really awesome. So these are the options, okay, of the kinds of pictures that you can add to your Sheikah Slate. So let's start with the weapon pictures. We're going to take them all, and it costs 18,000 rupees, so let's buy those. Check that out. Every single weapon in the game you can find with your Sheikah Slate now. <laughs> How awesome is that? So as you can see, there's a ton of weapons just right there, and that's just one page. I'm going to show you guys legit what it comes with. So let's do the materials. I'm going to buy all of these as well. It's 3,100 rupees. So let's buy those. Sun shrooms, mighty bananas. I mean, that's sick. Uh, let's do enemy pictures because I want to get my Lynels and all of those. 5,800 rupees for that. And let's do Faunas. Eight thousand rupees, let's buy that. And let's buy another picture or other picture I don't really know what that one is really to tell you tell you the truth oh. Oh. yeah so we just tricked out our freaking Sheikah slate like oh. legit to the max dude um, so I'm gonna show you guys and girls what this includes so this Hyrule compendium you could find giant horse the white horse the Lord of the mountain freaking stall horse the bloopies freaking anything you freaking 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 want energetic rhino beetle like that's crazy sick so all right let's see okay here's the monsters guardians you know guardian scouts uh, of all the levels Giga Blade Masters, you could you could actually scout them out this time. <laughs> That's so cool. Um, so let's go ahead and move over to the uh, materials. I guess these spots are empty because uh, I haven't encountered them in the game yet. But all of the materials that you want, you can easily find. And what else do we got? So the weapons. Oh, the weapons. I'm just going to let you guys check this out. Like, what's really cool about the weapons, too, is because you can click on them and see their properties, their common locations for many of them. Um, that's just, I mean, what else can you ask for, really? I've never seen this weapon, the Zora Sword. I don't know. I don't know where. I have no idea where to find that. But now I do, I guess. So that's pretty sweet. That looks like a cool sword. Thunder blades. Oh, 40. That's such a powerful weapon, too, man. I love that weapon. All right, YouTube, so I hope this video helped you guys. I hope you guys go ahead and upgrade this stuff, get the rupees, spend the cash, don't be cheap, and this is so freaking cool. You'll be able to find anything, flame blades, all your foods, freaking whatever, dude. So I hope this helped out. Love you guys all, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching my videos. You guys are awesome. Thank you once again. 
please like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure to share. That really helps out a lot with, uh, with everything. And I'll talk to you guys soon. God bless. Cheers. <laughs>